Let's have a look at how we can integrate Test Complete with Azure DevOps. Now the end-to-end -end process we're going to build and run with is based on this workflow. You write your Test Complete tests on your local machine and you will create a repository, a Git repository in your ADO instance and you will commit that Test Complete project to the repository in ADO. You'll have your manual tests defined in ADO and we will link the automated tests that we create to those tests in Azure DevOps. When we're ready to define the process for execution, we create a pipeline and that pipeline specifies the tests that we want to execute, where we're going to execute them and the schedule that we'll execute those tests on. When we run the pipeline, it deploys the test to an agent machine where there's an agent service running that is responsible for running test complete or test execute, executing the tests, and then capturing the test results and feeding them back to Azure DevOps. And those test results are recorded against the manual test cases we've already defined in ADO so that we can then report on those tests within the Azure DevOps interface. Now, before we can walk that process through end to end, we need to complete some preparation work and there's four steps we need to complete up front. First, we need to create the Azure DevOps Git repository for the test complete project. Second, we need to bind the test complete project to Azure DevOps so that the two can talk. Then we need to link our test cases that we've written in test complete to the manual tests we've defined in Azure DevOps. And of course, we need to configure the agent and connect the agent to Azure DevOps so that it's in a state ready to run our automated tests. So let's look at the preparation process first, and then second, we'll walk through that end-to-end -end process of writing and executing and reporting on our test runs.